Welcome back guys. Today's video, I wanted to go over hooking up the Rapsodo to GS Pro. And I'm gonna start by just turning the device on. We'll go to our tablet screen here. I've got a Samsung tablet and we'll open up the Rapsodo app. I've got two magnets on the back of my MLM2 Pro. So I will mount mine to my steel door behind me using the magnetic mount on the back. I'll go into the tablet and we just want to connect to the device. While that's happening, I'll put it, I'll mount it on the wall. And you can see I've got two magnets. I mount it on the frame of my door and I just slide it up and down to adjust. And then I plug the power in um, on the side there and I am good to go. I'm all mounted up, we are square. And after the MLM2 Pro connects, we'll have that blue light behind us. We're gonna hit start a session choose third-party apps, awesome golf, and we're gonna authenticate now. There we have it, the authentication is successful. One thing I always like to do after I authenticate is I like to go into the app and disconnect the MLM2 Pro. The light should then turn red. And then I like to close out of the Repsoto app and lock up, shut down my tablet. Next, um, I'll turn on the projectors over here. We'll get both going. I've got one for floor projection. And we will go over to our desktop, which is right above me, and I will start up the connector, which will open up GS Pro. and it'll also open up the webcam putting and it will connect to the MLM2 Pro. You'll see the light in the bottom left there go from red to blue to green, showing that it's connected. And then webcam putting will open up along with the GS Pro API. And mine will lock to specific zones on that screen Next, what you can see is I've got the webcam putting window showing my Google Chromecast. I want to display my OBS floor projection. So I'm going to right click my floor projection scene and we're gonna cast that to that right window, which is the floor. And in that scene, I'm gonna turn off a couple of the items and we'll go to practice mode in GS Pro and I'll just show you the range. But I'm all connected up and ready to go. I just need to cast that screen using Google Chrome. I'll hit the cast button. We're gonna cast a screen to the office projector. It'll be our floor projection overlay. We don't need sound. I'll hit share and you'll notice my floor now is projecting the data from GS Pro. And that's it. I'm ready to hit a shot. We are all set up and ready to go. So there you have it. If you got an MLM2 Pro and you want to connect to GS Pro, it's that simple. I've got videos on how to do it. And if you need help, shoot me a message, like the video, subscribe for more content like this, and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks guys.